Oh shit, it's time for part two of You Know What, the Pog series. That's right, following my first episode where I bought a tub of Pogs and I went through them on camera with you. Today I have another tub of Pogs and I'm going to do the same. Uh, this one, however, was marked slightly different. This is called the Pog-like game with slammers. I don't actually think there's any slammers in here because those are like the thick plastic things and... Uh, Right, none of them here. So as with last time, I'm gonna go take the cellar tape off. We're gonna crack it open, we're just gonna dive straight in because there's not much back story needed for this. Right, BRB. All right, I am back. Let's crack this open. And we'll take a very quick look and then I'll change my ca oh, Okay, there are a few slammers actually. So if you watched the first episode, you'll know this is a lot more Pogs than last time, but uh, I'll spend less time trying to work out exactly the Pog series this time. And, as with last time, I shall be using a book as a background. It is, once again, Mythology of the British Isles, Joffrey Ash. By the end, I will have some kind of licensing agreement with Joffrey Ash, I'm sure, because I've advertised his book twice now. I don't even know if he's still alive. Anyway, right, I'm going to zoom in and change camera angles. Be happy. Hey, right, okay, so I'm just going to put my hand, dip my hand into this box that's off screen, and we're going to take a. Oh! Oh, I thought it was hollow! Wait, what? Oh, yo! Yo, wait, is this like. Haha! <laughs> is this a Gundam ripoff? Oh! Okay, there's nothing on the back. Right, okay, this isn't. That is definitely. A, like, it's a weird mishmash of, like, Starscream from Transformers and, like, the RX-78 with, like, um, the shield and I'll, I'll put a picture on screen, but... Yeah, that's definitely a weird Gundam rip-off thing there. Interesting. Next up, we've got a worm with a tie. Okay, it's another... So, I, I'm really curious about these now because, um... If you remember with the first one, we had Madcaps. At least they had like an artist who wrote his name and stuff. What even is that? Why does that worm have a tie? Okay, cool. Um, next up, it's an eight ball. There we are. I don't even know which, no, I guess it's that way because eight's meant to have slightly smaller on the top, I think. Another blank one. Weird eight ball, okay. These are really fascinating. Uh, ooh, we got a hollow one. Oh my god, that took so long. Oh, yo, we've got Poison. Uh, there was a series called Pure Poison, wasn't there? Uh, this has no relation, presumably. we got, like, a weird skull breaking out of diamonds. That's interesting. Oh, and next one. Ooh, yo. I'm liking that. That's a kind of, like, fantasy guy wielding a sword with the skull on of it. No, whoa, hang on. Hello. CD 95301-12 Wait. No, okay, the rest of them don't have any... I thought for a second I'd like missed out on a code or something, but no. We... Oh my Jesus, what is this? Uh, poison 21, that's number 21. What is going on? Are those... What even is that? Are those like arms, legs, hands, feet? I, I can't work out what that is. I, I can read the word poison and the number 21, but it says no code on the back. Okay, then. Ne Ooh, hang on. Made in Taiwan. Man, these are all over the shop. Some of them have information. Man. That's the male symbol. Man. Ooh, can we get a full set? Can I get woman? Next. We... Ankylosaurus. Now, I will say, Ankylosaurus is my favourite type of dinosaur. Uh, I always, always up for supporting more Ankylosaurus, like memorabilia. Memorabilia? I mean, technically, kind of. But what a strange one. Why is this... T Man, that is not in scale with... It. Actually, do you know, that might be in scale with... It's not a T-Rex, necessarily, but, like... Uh, Allosaurus is... Weren't they smaller, I think? I don't know. Oh, we've got someone pumping up. Oh, sorry, pumping iron. I didn't read the bottom there. Look at him. He's lifting it, but the weight's weighing him down. And I can't tell if, like, is he flabby or is just his shirt, like, bunching up because his belt is coming up. That's weird. Another blank one. 
All right then. God, there's so many of these. Oh, yo. Hang on. That's pretty cool. All right, I'm digging that. That's, that's really cool. Gives me uh, Yu-Gi-Oh vibes. Skull Servant to 95301-2. So it's a different set. These are obviously like knockoffs and stuff. Um, obviously made in Taiwan probably. You could buy like I'm sure a box of these for like a pound or something. Got a weird yin yang, and like one of the things is crosses. Was that an ankh? No, that looks like a cross actually. And the other's like a slightly off checkered pattern. That's weird. Next up. Oh, wait, hang on. 1995 GT. What does that say? Woodland Spirit. Oh, it, is that a woman or a man? I can't tell, but their neck is kind of weird. So 1995 GT. So like, these must be surely unofficial pogs. They're just ripped off from other pog brands, maybe. We've got the basketball player. Oh, he does not. And that those eyes are a bit strange. Number three. Look, he's number twenty-three. There's nothing on the back again. All right. What will this one be? Engine Jim. Jim Engine. I'm reading it as Engine Jim, I suppose. He's like guy with a weird... Is it kind of Native American, I guess? The massive nose. Wait. That is a guy, right? That's his eyes and his nose and his head and ears and chin. So it looks a bit like a bottle as well, doesn't it? Is that... That is a person, right? God, that's strange. I have no idea where that is. That is definitely... It's got to be a person, right? But his neck looks like a bottle. I don't know. I, I, I give up and I'm moving on. I don't understand. Uh, what is that? A bowling ball? With three lanes on it and stuff? I thought for a second that was like the Bitcoin uh, symbol. And I was like, whoa. Are they, are they being prescient? Do they know what's going to happen in the future? Uh, oh. Okay. I don't know who that is. Um, he looks... He probably is some kind of superhero. Because, um, man, I read quite a few different comics when I was younger from, like, Image and stuff. That they had some weird character designs. But they, they were kind of cool. Um, hey... We've got that a Lucha Libre kind of Iron Man rip-off kind of thing. Uh, yeah. Actually, one of one of the comics I quite like, Bedrock. Who is he from? He's from like a team or something. Um, I'll put it on screen, but they were a kind of, uh, they were a kind of cool comic group. Uh, ooh, the Packers. I'm aware of the Packers. I know they're like NFL, aren't they? But... I don't live in America. I, I don't follow NFL. I know the Packers are a team. Green Bay Packers. So G there. That kind of sounds right, but it's probably wrong. Yo. Got some psychedelic happy thing. Oh, hang on. We've got something else again. Series 3B. Yeah, so I reckon what's happened here is some company has literally copied the designs of, like loads of different pog things and have just sold them kind of like wish you know these days you're like i don't know typing pogs in wish maybe oh i should do that one day um so we got another superhero uh, from the same group as the last one probably uh next uh oh okay hang on i kind of like this one series 3e okay I'm, I'm digging that one that's got a weird frog alien hieroglyphic vibe. I'm putting that to the side. That's a, that's a banger. Ooh. Is this two bangers in a row? I, I don't know why I'd read Pog's bangers, but whatever. Um, yeah, like a magic eight ball, but it's hollow. Kind of like that as well. Yeah, okay, that's going in the good pile. I should have put some of the other ones, but it's too late now. Wait a second, is that car? Cars from um, Jojo Part Two, Wamu, one of the one of the um, Pillar Men. I swear to God, there is just one of the Pillar Men from Jojo Part Two. Well, all right then. 
I mean, it was around at the time, probably. This was made in, like, the 90s. We've got a very angry shark. All right. And quickly check in the backs, but I know they're all going to be blank. Ooh. Oh, hang on. That's made in Taiwan, too. Okay, this is a pretty cool one as well. That, for some reason, right, that's giving me vibes like Kingdom Hearts mixed with, like, Kamen Rider. And I, I don't want to think any more on that. Why that tells me that there, because I'll be here for hours. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay, this is actually a kind of clever one. So well done to whoever created this, and then these people ripped them off. Um, snake Eyes, double one. Because when you roll Snake Eyes in most games, it's really bad. And it's like staring into a snake's eyes, I guess. Oh, got more dice. Oh, uh, another one. Do you get it? Six, six, six. And there's death and stuff, because the number of the beast leads to death or something. Also, cracking Iron Maiden song, although controversially, I prefer a few of their other ones. Um, but we'll get into that eventually on a Listen Toys. What's Listen Toys? You'll find out. So we got a hockey hockey stick. Ooh! Oh, yeah, it's hollow as well. It's got swirls. Dude, the, the 90s nostalgia is... Is that, like, tight? I don't, I don't know what's going on with that. There's, there's so much going on. Um... Is that another superhero? Maybe? That is the right way around, isn't it? Yeah, probably. Okay, cool. Uh, oh, next. Oh, oh, this one's seen better days. It's a handbag. Is it a handbag? Wait, no, it's not. It's a fish. I thought that was like a bag and that was, you know, that was the handle. You know what I mean? It's a weird fish thing. Okay, if it was in better condition, I'd maybe say I like the patterns, but whatever. Okay, we've got... Hi! <laughs> what the fuck is this? Hi! That... Like, it's so off-center, and he doesn't look... Oh my... I don't know what's going on with that one. That... Oh, that's made in Taiwan as well. Thank you, Taiwan. You have produced some absolutely incredible pieces. Hey! Got, like... Why is he holding his gun like that? Is there no recoil with this gun? Because otherwise he's just gonna like smack himself in the face. Also just like break his elbow or something. That's uh... Never hold your gun like that. Not that I've ever held a gun, but I... I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe you should hold it like that. Don't take my word for it. Look up. Online. Uh, we've got a spider with six legs. His eyes are a little bit off. He's got weird banana peels as a pattern. Very interesting. There's so many of these. Holy shit. Oh, we've just got... Basically, we've got a YouTuber avatar of, like, a guy that will reveal, like, games from the 80s you never knew about. And that is, like, YouTube thumbnail thing. I don't know. Um, next up... Ooh. We've got what looks like... A very angry Drax from Guardians of the Galaxy, maybe. Except he's got one arm. What the hell is he doing with his other arm? He looks very squished. That's very awkward. Uh, no, that's got nothing. Sorry for not checking the back of all of these, but you can, I'm pretty sure most of these are going to be um, nondescript ones. Poison. Oh. I kind of dig that, actually. That's the. Um, that's obviously the smiley face, but like. rotting. That's, that's kind of cool. Not, not good enough to go in the, like, banger pile, but, uh, ooh. <gasps> Yo! <laughs> okay. Here's another rip-off, then. This is a Zaku, which I'll put on screen here, from Gundam. At least the head and, like, piping and stuff is. The body is different enough, to be fair, right? You couldn't say this is a Zaku. This is no Zaku, boy! No Zaku! <laughs> but, like... The mono eye, the pipes, the head, the, yeah. That, it's really interesting though, I'm putting that in the banger pile. Gundam ripoffs, ooh. Uh, it's a spider with the moon, is that the moon? I oh god, I don't even know what's going on with that pattern. That's a spider, cool. Uh, ooh, that looks like, I don't know, a still from X-Men or something, what does that say? 77 of 87. Yeah, this, these, as I said, these are definitely, like, 
ripoffs of other series because like we had the ones of like series 7a and 7b and stuff like that lots of eight balls i've noticed um on the back of a ninja like a really muscly ninja i reckon right here's my theory uh i know in asian countries the number eight is lucky so maybe they were like oh eight um there we are we'll print print loads of eight balls because eight is lucky the dog catcher. Ah, oh, this is uh, this goes along with the baseball player, I suppose. Then, He's holding on to that dog, but that dog does not seem to care and is going on his own. Ooh, oh yo, hello, poison, poison, dude. All right, I really like that one. That's really cool. That's like peak. That's peak like weird nineties merch where like. Your parents would buy it for you because it was really cheap and they're like oh you like these things and you're like well yeah but only like a certain type of these things um yeah lots of eight balls again there we are we've got 888 and there's a weird cat pink cat furry thing carrying them jesus christ even back in the 90s the furries were everywhere all right next up we uh international karate connection association Okay, what? That's Seal Beach, California, probably, maybe. Six, 95. Nothing on the back. Yet again, probably taken from some kind of weird POG series. Uh, also, these aren't great. These are like really basic cardboard. And as you can see, like the colours are bleeding through a little bit on the sides and stuff. We've got a weird clock with bats on. Right, yeah, I'd, <laughs> I've got... <laughs> Jesus Christ, this is hard to commentate on. Hey, that looks like a pure poison one, doesn't it? It's got that, like, skull design, everything's hollow, kind of cool colours. Yeah, kind of liking that. So pure poison, if you haven't seen the first one, is actually a POG series. They just ripped it off. We've got a weird angel with a harp. I kind of like the I like the art. It's very 80s, isn't it? Yeah, that looks like a still from, like, a cartoon or something like he-man oh and that's upside down is it thunder lizard number 47 uh from some nondescript pog series look at that that's kind of cool though i like thunder lizard uh isn't that what they call godzilla no or one of godzilla's enemies i don't know bad to the bone do you get it because he's he's a skull wearing a bandana like, those bones are hollow, but the, the skull isn't. So are those bones not real bones, then? Is that skull wearing fake bones? Because, like, I... Oh, I don't like that one. I do not like that one. That looks like Nightmare Fueled Harley Quinn. Uh, it looks like night, uh, like a version of Harley Quinn that was drawn by someone who's never seen Harley Quinn, but was told down the phone by someone of what she looks like. Uh, and still didn't understand, so drew the best they could. What the fudge is this? Series 6E. Just abstract. I, that's not even, I don't even know what's going on. With that one, that is strange. What? So, oh, so what? Sorry, I didn't read the so. I was hoping it just said what? If I could keep that in the background, and when I couldn't describe a pog, I could just point to it then. I'm still going to do that. So what? Hang on. Yeah, now you can only see, read what in the background. Uh, okay, it's a zombie pouring slime on his baked potato, maybe. Fair enough. Uh, Jesus Christ, uh, there's so many left as well. We've got Vaboom! Uh, he's, a, he's, a, he's a bomb or something, I guess. Um, the <laughs> wow, the bomb, as I just described. There we are. He is the bomb. Oh, wait a second. That is, hang on, 20 of 87. So, all ah, right, so you know the other one I said, oh, that looks like an X-Men character, that, like, the close-up of the girl's face? I thought I recognised the art style, and I fucking do. This is an X-Men scan. That is Wolverine, but they've literally painted him a different colour. Unless this is like a limited outfit that he wore during like one series or something. 
That is, I mean, I'm going to keep that to the side because, God, I love rip-off things as well. Uh, ooh, hey, there we go. We got the full set, boys. Oh, my God. I tell you, if this is a PSA 10, right, a man and a woman limited edition POG is worth literally nothing. Right, next up is... Ooh, what the fudge is going on there? I don't... No. Nope. I don't have time. I don't have time to discuss that. That's a, that's a Greek man holding a baby goat to his bosom. We've got um, poison brain, po poisonous brain, brew brain. No, that is brain, isn't it? Bre poisonous something. Br yeah. What? The oh my Jesus Christ, man! Some of this artwork is a proper trip. Uh, we've got fights. Fight. We got like. A dog, two dogs and a cat or something? Okay... Oh wait, ah! Oh, I see, right, it's... Ah, yeah, okay, sorry, the background is the dog, the cat is pulling the dog's tail and the dog is biting the cat's tail. Um, and basically it shows that an eye for an eye leaves the whole world blind. Ooh! I'm liking that as well, that's like probably some DC ripped artwork or something, but... Yeah, that's going in the bangers pile, I think. Uh, right. We have uh, a ninja appearing from the void. Yeah, that's kind of cool as well, isn't it? Okay, yeah, I will put her in the pile. I know what you guys are saying. Put her in the pile. Put it in the pile. Um, remember to spam that in the, in the comment section below. We've got a, a skull with an eight ball being hit by an arrow. I don't know. Wait, hang on. Sorry, I just saw this off screen. We've got a double of man. Oh, man. Get it? Oh, man. Uh, right, okay. Also, just to show you, right, we've been about 20 minutes, and I've done one stack of these. We are going to be here a while. I hope you've got snacks and stuff, because... Uh, and I'm going through these fairly quick. You've seen my previous videos. You know I, I take my time. Ooh, Pure Poison. Is this... Ah, uh, still blank. Okay, right. Uh, I think most of these, if not all of them, are going to be blank, actually. But Pure Poison was a series I kind of liked from the first video. We got a, a, a scorpion on a shiny skull. All right then. Uh, do feel free to pause the video, by the by the way, if you want to see these things in more details. Yo, we got frog alien again, kind of trippy frog, trippy frog boy kind of thing. Put that to the back uh, in the banger pile. Got the bomb again, a double. Ugh. Okay. Well. You're bound to get doubles when you have clearly ripped off thing. Rat poison. Okay, very interesting. Also, I do apologise. It does seem that uh, one of my neighbours is setting off some kind of uh, strimmer. Sorry if you can hear that in the background. Yo! Another of these really cool robot things. Definitely keeping that in the banger pile. Look at that. Ah, I really like that. Colour scheme, the hollowness, you know. It's all the... Hey, we've got, like, another superhero rip-off person that maybe looks like an Ankylosaurus turned superhero. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with any of these. The annoying thing is, because these are all ripped off, like, I can't tell you what series they're from or work out what they're meant to be. What? Is... Are they... Ah, oh, so, oh, sorry, right. So it's a flea on a dog's nose. It's another dog thing. So remember War and there was dogs in the background? Okay. Man, there's so many series they've ripped off here. It's weird. Got a weird pink and green spider thing. There's not much to say about that. I'm briefly checking the back. But, oh, Made in Taiwan. Some of them will say Made in Taiwan. Others will not say anything. And a few of them, the rare ones, will have a code. You've got a man who seems to be flossing himself with a snake. Very interesting. All right, then, uh, next one. Ooh. Man, that almost looks like it could be an X-Men character. Like, weird version of Cable, but it's not. I don't think, anyway. Uh, right, our next one. Oh, hang on, it's this way, is it? That's strange. A man is stuck in, like, a, a bubble made of the yin-yang. I, I don't know. I, I don't understand it. 
it was a different era back then. We got a dollar sign thing, the shiny, of course it's shiny. It'd be weird if it wasn't shiny. Oh my goodness. We've got infinite, no, eight ball snake. So it's an eight ball, but they've cored out the middle and there's like a rattlesnake going through it. I, I feel like I'm having a fever dream and trying to describe to you guys what I'm seeing, but you're seeing it as well, right? I, I hope so. <laughs> Ah, we got another one. Ah, so is that like ray gun thing just now? Well, we got another one holding up like a lightsaber, maybe? Or just a sword that's glowing? I don't know anymore. I've lost... Oh, hang on. We've got blazing eight ball. Yeah, what? Eight balls everywhere today. Eight balls just... The, the, welcome to the eight ball channel. Uh, made in Taiwan. <laughs> oh my goodness, so we got a pool set up here with an 8-ball, obviously. Right, cool, alright then, what's, what's next? We've got cross-court volley with a, like, triceratops and uh, playing ball, play, playing tennis or someone, I, I do not know. Uh, <laughs> right, next up, see isn't this great content, oh my, it's the number 8 again. I would say, wow, there's a weird obsession with the number 8, but as I explained previously, 8 is massive in Asian countries, and I think Taiwan may be like... Wow, okay, <sighs> right, let's try and find the rare pogs where the number 8 doesn't appear, shall we? I mean, that's 5 8. Isn't triple 8, I think, the like, really popular one in Asian countries? I don't know. Oh. I was about to say it's the Eight of Diamonds, but no, it's clearly the Queen, because it's the, the Queen of Diamonds. That's kind of cool, I guess. Pogs of, like, a, a, a suit of cards. That, yeah, that's not bad. Um, shut up! Okay, well, thanks for watching. See you next time. Right, uh, that, yeah, again, is, like, Series 5, 5G. They knew. They knew all along. Mm. Uh, right, the next one. Uh, oh. Beetle Maniac. I, oh, whoa, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is a, a real one. Hang on. Watch for limited edition Slammer Whammers. This is an official Slammer Whammer. Is it, though? Is it just me or is the centering off a little bit? No, I might be correct, actually. Imperial 94. Put that on its own pile then. That might be like an actual official one. Oh my god! Do you remember the days of official pogs? Back in the first episode? I feel like I'm losing my mind with these ones. Uh, we got another pure poison one that just doesn't... Oh wait, no, hang on. Poison. Hey, did I say pure? Can't... Oh yeah, pure. Pure poison. There we are. Yeah. Cool. You can kind of instantly tell the art style, but obviously it's not an official one. It's Wait, hang on. What's this? Pog 10. Okay, clearly a child owned this. What the hell is Pog 10? Ah, oh, are they trying to like make their own? Because like, didn't Pogs have their own power things? For some series? Got a very angry frog there. I don't know what he's crushing in his hand, but he's crushing something. Jesus Christ. He's a muscular frog as well. Right. We're more than halfway through. Uh, oh, it's that nightmare one again, where the man is trapped in the yin-yang sign. Fair enough. We've all been there. Uh, we... what? It looks like a, oh, a woman set up an umbrella, but look, the hole in the umbrella is just above her head. Looks a little bit like Sephiroth as well. Obviously, it's not Sephiroth. Uh, it's just a woman. <laughs> okay. So we've got, like, got another one of the weird superhero team, and this time he's got, like, a three-part nunchuck, or nunchaku. I oh man, there's the, I I I don't I don't even know. Like I'm not. If any of these, by the way, if you recognise the designs of any of these, please let me know because I'd really love to hear it. That looks like that looks like the album cover of a synthwave album, right? Is it just me? That's like yeah, that's perfect. Like weird synthwave art. Uh, oh, that looks like. Don't know. Uh, is it like, is it a Thundercats rip-off thing? I do not know. Uh, oh, hello. 
Yeah, look at that. He's got a space Tommy gun, maybe. And uh, <clears throat> you can tell it's a space one because he's got a space helmet on. Or like a sci-fi thing. Again, I this is probably... I'm going to add that to my banger pile, actually. I like that. Um, ooh, we got another like void... Oh, yo. That's cool. That's... Yeah, th I, I like the pose with that one. Plus green is my favourite colour. So that's going in the banger pile. Oh. Oh dear. They knew about the Illuminati all along. In fact, this video was sponsored by your boy, the Illuminati. Oh no, no, they're not sponsoring this one actually. Made in Taiwan. Alright then, cool. Uh, we've got an uppercut coming from a very angry muscular man. Who is again, I'm sure, the star of a very limited comic series that people read in like the 80s. Uh, oh, yeah, not really digging that one. That's a bit weird. The, the pose is a little bit off. He's not even, like, centred. Yeah, no. Sorry, ninja guy, but you're not going with your other two friends. Wow, my camera's picked this up as a face. That's pretty good. That's pretty decent art, especially, like, man, look at the detail on the face. That's impressive. It's just that, what is going on with that hair? And the, like, shoulder pad thing? Very interesting. Uh, we're near the end of the second pile now. Cha cha cha. Cha cha cha. I don't know. I don't know how to read that, but. What? I don't. It. it so it's. Uh, okay, right. Sorry, so it's a monster uh, who's got like a, a horn maybe and is putting on a magic show for all his. Fans or something? I don't know. Um, I sincerely do not understand that one. Oh, looks like someone's got a bright idea. Ding! It's, it's, what, it's what you'd have when you have a good idea. Which is clearly not something the designer of these pogs had. Right! It is, oh! It's Robocop, boys, but he's gold. Uh, actually, do you know, I may be wrong in saying he's Robocop there. So he's got a propeller on his head. Is that how he flies? Because surely they'll just dislocate your head from the rest of your body. Uh, which, you know, is a bad thing. Uh, okay. Is that Humpty Dumpty? With, like, hairy ears? Or, like, side parted hair? That's strange. Jesus Christ. I'm never going to not see that now. Oh, back to the eight balls again, boys. Although, I'll give them credit. This isn't just an 8-ball, they have like made it weird and corrupted and stuff. It's the Nether, nether Void 8-ball. Uh, oh, oh, hang on. Uh, two tunes. Spaz... Spaz caps. Alright then. Uh, <laughs> apparently, that's a swear word in the UK. But you're probably American, so it's fine. Was... What's it? Spaz caps? Toons. Okay, so clearly uh, Toons was like the series. Don't know what's happening there though, like Flower Man is holding the head of his enemy who dead wear a flower on his hat. Uh, which he callously killed from a patch of flowers or something. We've got a weird snake eight ball motif thing going on again. Alright, we're on to our final thing and we've got some actual whammers so I'm going to keep those till the end because they may be the only official thing we actually have in this one uh, we've got I don't know I don't know how you meant to even look at it to be honest oh hang on made in Taiwan so the centering is that way St George's Cross but like really weird I don't know um, got an eight ball again I see double I do believe Though it's hard to keep track of all the... Oh, my God. Yeah, we got a double of that again. I'm putting that to the side. I do not like that. Ooh. Is that... That's a member of X-Force. Surely, right? That's that, that's definitely an X-Man. Um, and, yeah, it just seems to be wearing the X-Force uniform. At least the original X-Force. I could be wrong. Hit me up in the comments if I am. Or if I'm not. Okay. That's kind of cool. Ooh, purple teeth. We've got Poison. There we go then. Uh, right, also all of these are still unofficial, by the way. 
We've got uh, Kievman, Kievman with double, double backhanded daggers. I don't know what led to that being a thing, but okay then. We've got, oh, it's another sword held aloft and glowing with a sense of justice. Oh, CD 95301-1. Did we pull uh, 95301-2 earlier? And then 12, I think, was the other one. That may actually be a set, I don't know. Oh, we got that, that spider peel banana thing again. Spider spider peel? Banana peel spider. I, my mind has gone today. I, I've had to process so many of these nonsensical images that, like, words have stopped me having any meaning. We've got Atlas holding up the world. I don't know if that's meant to be Atlas. That's probably the superhero's name, though, isn't it? We've got the knight. That's... I kind of like that, actually. That looks like something you'd see in an anime, like a villain or something, would leave, like, a pog to know that he'd been at the crime... at a crime scene. Scene of a crime. That's the word. Uh, oh, we've got a bus. Hang on. Yellow cab. And look, there's a man reading a map in the front seat. Oh, it's the dog background one again. That's very strange. It has nothing to do with dogs or cats. We're okay. Uh, right, let's move these actual cool slammers. Uh, we've got a monster truck. Just says monster, mind. But okay, it is a monster truck. Yet again, it's from the, like... Weird. No, oh, that's the yellow cab from the previous one, right? Hang on. Uh, not quite. Yeah, no, the one in the background looks more squished for the monster pog. Okay, then. Interesting. Um, not sure what's going on there. That looks like maybe a foot. But it's got eyes, is it? No, I don't know. I feel like that is... Ah, and that's uh, series 6H. So, I'm guessing, like, when it says Series 6H, so it's from Series 6, and it's number H. It's just a weird way of phrasing it. Pure Poison again? Yeah, boy. That's pretty cool. Thanks, Pure Poison. Despite the fact you're not actually giving us a real po Pure Poison. Oh. Yeah, not digging that one. That's... Oh, he looks so smug for some reason. He's, like, holding that and just looking really smug to be in a... Weird, like, green screen suit, basically. Uh, ooh. Okay, right, that is quintessential 90s there. It's a pog, it's a skull, there's fire, and it's needless, like, holographic stuff. If I had a summer pogs, right, in one, in one image for, like, generic pogs, not the themed ones, because they're, like, the Looney Tunes ones are pretty cool, but that would be it. Uh, I've put that on the bangers pile. Oh, it's, uh, is this like Mayan art or something? Because it had like the frog alien thing that I really liked. They look like weird tall chocobos from Final Fantasy. So I'm going to add that to my banger pile because I love chocobos. Uh, oh my fucking god. Can we, why, why can we not escape? Like, balloon lip Holly Quinn. Uh, oh. We found it, boys. Wait, hang on. <laughs> so I was about to say, yeah, this is quintessential, like, 90s mainstream stuff. Rappin Rappator. So it should be Raptor, but for some reason it's Rappator. Uh, he doesn't quite look like a rap. Uh, I suppose he does look like a Raptor. He's got shades on. I love that. God, that's so stupid. That is... I'm going to put that to the side. I haven't needed the what one, because all of them have that. Ooh. Hey, we have Joker to go with Harley Quinn, except this this one doesn't have massive lips. Actually, is that the same colour? Yeah, it is. Okay, so this is somehow matches up. Oh, 12. Yeah, I guess so. Don't know what series this is from. Maybe it's the, like, superhero rip-off series, but, you know, it do be pretty interesting. Oh, is that the dog from Tom and Jerry? That's the dog from Tom and Jerry, isn't it? Yeah, Brutus? No, mate. I don't know. I, I, that, that's my assumption. I feel like that's his name. But hey, you got another pure poison. He's a genie. We'll grant you all your wishes. I wish that we'd only have two pogs left and then we can get on to the slammers. All right. We, hey, we got another pure, pure, pure. Poison, poison. Oh, no. It just says poison. 
Poison, 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 poison. I'm alright then. Uh... Oh. Oh. Yep. I was sh so shocked that I dropped that. Oh. That's very strange. Uh, right. So, we've uh, got the big plastic ones now. So, let's get a whammer out, shall we? Uh, ooh. This is World Cap Super Caps. Authentic. Uh, Federation. Yeah, boy. Ooh. So, yeah. So, uh, I don't know exactly what's going on here, but it's an official WCF. And it's got, like, moulding in it. It was like two dips or something. I don't understand why. You meant to like put your fingers there? But th that is genuinely kind of cool. I do really like that actually. Super caps, of course, they were the ones that made like mad caps, monster caps, stuff like that. Oh, we've got. Oh, that's an interesting one. Okay, so we've got like a non treated one, it looks like. I don't know if this is like a mistake or intentionally like this, but. There's no hollow design, it's exactly like the last one I looked at, but it's just purely just the black plastic with the moulding. Interesting. Uh, oh, we got a double of the blue one then. Interesting, that's got that moulding thing again. And I'm guessing the last one is... Whoa, actually, never mind. Yo! Okay, right, um, so this isn't going to mean anything to you guys, but this is really heavy. It's like... Slate or something? Like, oh, it, it's metal. I'm an idiot. Yeah, that's just a straight up heavy metal coin. Uh, and it's the pure poison thing. Although, for some reason, they've got rid of pure poison and it just says poison. And he's slam dunking because it's the 90s, obviously. Hey, that's pretty cool. I mean, it's off center as all hell because, like, there's a big rim that doesn't really even out or anything. But. That's pretty cool. That is just like a bit of metal, like copper, not copper. I, I don't know what metal it is. I, I'm not even going to make a guess. Yeah. Right. Cool. So I'm going to put them all into piles now and then I'll give us a recap. All right. I am back. So I've sorted everything into piles. Uh, the piles are all the random ones, the ones I like, the metal ones and the doubles. And take a very quick look at the cool ones again. So I toss them into here. And then we'll finish up. So there's the moon. There's that really cool robot thing. Wolverine but black. Frog alien. We've got void ninja. We've got a uh, hooded masked man. Uh, oh yeah, the, uh, the, the rad pure poison one. We've got the not Zaku. The weird but cool symbol. The eight ball, because we haven't seen enough of those. We've got Ray Gun Man. Hey, there we are. Weird frog lizard alien thing again. That thing. The skull. Actually, I'm going to end on the skull. We're going to do Blaster Man, Void Ninja Part 2, Rapping Raptor, and this. Well, that wraps up Part 2. Uh, I've got one more, and the last one actually has a lot of the thicker whammers in. So that's why I kept it for last. I don't really know why, because maybe the designs aren't going to be that interesting. But thank you very much for sitting through this 45 minutes of me slowly losing my mind, trying to make sense of cheap Taiwanese rip-offs of pogs and stuff. Uh, keep an eye out. Part 3 will be out in a week or two. Uh, and until next time, goodbye.